Now all of a sudden... That stench. You're just like I was when I ended up here and gave up on living. That's the stench of despair coming from you. You're right, you know. I won't live to see 20 with my disease. If you're going to kill me, you might as well just do it. You poor child. But you needn't worry. Simply join us, and you shall despair no more. You keep saying us. Who's us? You're working with others? Indeed. We are everywhere. We are very well acquainted. Don't tell me. Yes, the Wanderers. But there is more. What you call the dust. That is our truth. Sophisticated intelligence. Far more evolved than mankind. That is who we are. The Dread Dust! Dread Dust. What is that exactly? We began as an invention of your world. Medical nanomachines. We possess the ability to absorb the properties of any kind of matter. But as our numbers grew, we started to develop new traits. Those of a colony. These included infecting intelligent life, producing a resonance effect, and generating energy. The energy you've been using to generate your wormholes, that is created when we coalesce and crystallize. Surely no one is more aware of our magnificence than you. Oh no. But Seth, unlike other wanderers, a substantial part of your human personality appears to remain. Why is that? It was determined that this would be the most effective avenue to achieve our goal of endless propagation. It certainly was when it came to bringing the majority of the Charon Core into the fold. How could you do such a thing? Such a thing? Child, our physical forms have no individual intelligences of their own. Not in the truest sense. The dust has been dispersed into the atmosphere. We continually send and receive information with one another. This enables us to exist as a colony with one will and one intelligence. So you see, it is a wonderful thing. For when there is only one will, neither confrontation nor conflict can occur. There is no greater form of companionship. But sadly, there is hardly anyone or anything left in this world to join us. That is why we've turned our sights to yours. Our arrival will bring the peace mankind has yearned for for 10,000 years, yet has failed to achieve. That cannot be called peace. You have been poisoned by the humans, Virgil. AIs like you two should be on our side. But it looks like no amount of talk is going to convince you. So we're just going to have to take the information we need. What? Where? It, AI network intrusion. Uh, uh, an anomaly detected. Virgil! Don't you try to move! Ah. <laughs>
Finally! The wormhole control technology we've been waiting for! Now all that's needed is the power of Sahelanthropus. You're not... get it! What? You're not gonna get it! Because the captain's gonna stop you! 